Someone once said, if it was rain and brains, Roxy Robinson wouldn't even get wet. In Northern New York, they didn't come much dumber than Roxy the Weasel. To be frank, Roxy was a dog.
Everything was future as a spaghetti, they were marble jeans, or put in the city hall. So I took it from Mr. Dad, you know, want them alive. You try and hide them before you decide. You tell that is, that I don't want you here. The pop maker is on the store. Thank you. 
job. Get it? They said come back tomorrow. Ah, they don't know what you do. What's your name anyway? Brown? Brown? Sounds like a local bread. Lousy Brown? What about the Brown? Sounds like a state of local bread. You can't be just behind your teeth, Whitey. What do you send me? Yeah, I'm both seen alone.
Jerry Lake for his last job. Some <laughs> champion. He acted well for a couple of rounds, but Oswald tumbled the ball at Cotton Ball. This job had more practice than Macy's window. One punch was enough to send me back to the dressing room. Generally, I was a stretcher. But my face scalp the smell in the box. I come out and myself with a double, double lucky punch. How many times can it be a lucky punch? Then I rise up before my face is like a plate of mashed potatoes. I could have been a contender, Charlie. Look, <laughs> buddy, just in case you're wondering, I ain't part of furniture. So you eat it, or are you meat? I know. We'll have two banana bottles with a delight green with nuts and chocolate sauce. Two cream rolls on the donut.
yet the king. I have been privileged to obtain second billing at this city, Missouri, for a blood and Norfolk, Nebraska. And I will now perform for you a trick seen before only by the crown heads of Europe. From this act, I will produce not one rabbit, not two
if you look at the stuff that you said, uh, sure, I don't know how I'm working for one. No, the stuff is the guns. Uh, yeah, I mean, I mean, no, I mean, I'm, I'm not living in a state. Well, you'll have to ask cops. What's the hard question? Okay, okay, break this up. Come on, guys, split. This is police business. This is some police business. We gotta do it. See how stupid I can get back to it. Can I smoke it? Can you tell me if I'm okay to split this guy's name? No comment. You look at the stuff? No comment. Can I smoke it? Who the guns being used? Don't call on gas. No comment. How can I fix the fuck around me like that? No comment. Okay, get out of here. Now, we know there were five guys here. What else did you see? Nothing, I see nothing. You must have seen some tank. Nothing. Honestly, Mr. Cup, I see nothing. I came up for just this year. I got papers. I don't care. I see nothing. I just play music. I'm not even business. I don't need to know the books. Cop no function. What is the three? I'm a worst copy. <laughs> no, what is it found? Oh, it's a gun copy. A kind of a gun. It's a gun copy. <laughs> <laughs> no, go ahead. For a gun copy. I said you were a six month of course. And all that you can tell me is that it's a big gun. <laughs> you knew the way that was a good party. <laughs>
enough, guys. What? Quick, Matt, can you stop this enough? Sorry for that. I swear, I'm surrounded by a bunch of noisy sweats. Right. <laughs> Be not smart about that line to us, right? Right, right boss. We're gonna get right back on top, right? Right, right back on top, boss. I'm gonna kick that truck so calories. No, 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 You're nothing wrong, Louis. Nothing. <laughs> Me. See? In the... Don't move like Louis too quick. That's the root of our problem. We're behind the times. I don't get it, boss. No. We're never going to get on top of that kind of hardware. It's all fresh. Obsolete. See? You sure? We're going to get ourselves that good. You know the house of Shin Laundry? Only 40 Street? That's it, second floor behind the laundry. Thanks, Shady. I'll see you all soon. This is good news. I'll be sending you for Good work, Shady. You're going to run. Thanks, Sam Jack. Sam Floyd was a quiet a party. Now get out of here. Just like no. That 
when the woman was scared of death. Uh, don't mean scared, I mean concerned. Give <laughs> yourselves a little time. Thinking time, right, couples? Come on, baby. I'm gonna send it to someone to help us out of our little predicament. Ten cents only here, it's special. Talk to boss? Not a duck, dig a bilberry. A fool. A fool, we were fool. Not a dumb one, but this guy's a real McCoy. Louis the Gums, the very same. Office, Charlie Mann is ahead of the Gums. The best man in Chicago, right? Here's what we took. We arranged to meet with Danny Gay. We're going to be in the college to make the knuckles of you try. Right. But I don't drive fast. You don't drive, you mucks ahead. We're going to have to get ourselves a driver.
Mighty, Lord, on screen, very nice. Keep on. That was great, Klaus. It really swell. Told you, baby. Klaus, come on. What's the matter with you? Hey, Klaus, come on. I'm gonna explain all that smooth you with the Klaus, Folks, I'd like to learn yourself some freaks. As long as you're not talking about cabbages. Straightforward drive. No one knew Sam would be dug in the drive. It's the pay. Two hundred. Sam. Two dollars. Dollars? Sounds like dangerous driving. Yeah, it might get a little hot, but you don't get paid two hundred bucks for driving the hoop up, OK, you got yourself a drive. Good boy. Good boy. Things are starting to shape up real fast. And I'm getting real thirsty. <coughs> Blood thirsty.
you know. But I think it's fun and good luck. You mean you printed it yourself? No, I earned it. Word of God. Doing what? Oh, just this and that. Two, four. That's that. That stamp gave you $200. And the whole of us is dead for the afternoon. I don't believe you. You're putting me on. Look, if you get yourself outside the Grand Slam in 10 minutes, Listen, as he sit down with a good-looking driver, the money has a very close resemblance to yours, too. Okay? Okay. But you better not be putting me on, Buster. Cross my heart is on the level. So long.
think it'll be anything but yes. Oh, fancy Hollywood! Knock it off, will you, Blousey? You're putting me on. The honest truth, I told you. It's just that, well, if I don't get the sedan back soon, Fat Sam will have my face looking like a plate of yesterday's fettuccine. <laughs> Oh! 
okay, okay, I'm sure you did all you could. Now go home with your wash. That's the point, Lola. You hear me? Everything. Now come in here next. There's only one thing for it. You're gonna have to get him to help you. Okay, jump to our Foxy Malone. Call it! I'm in trouble. Real trouble. Now I got the company being in the lead.
You got me a crack at the title already? No, this is a different kind of job. Well, I'm tired. Come back in the morning. It'll be too late in the morning. You working for Bad Sam's to Cheddar? You shouldn't any damn where it hurts. in it for you. I'll do it!